You're watching WBAL TV, WBAL DT Baltimore. Live, local, late breaking. This is WBAL TV 11 News Saturday morning. Uh, question Are your feet ready for summer? Wearing those open toed sandals and flip flops? Well, there is more to healthy feet than a weekly pedicure. Although I just got mine yesterday. Joining us with more is Dr. Max Weisfeld. Good morning. Good morning. Always happy to have a podiatrist here to ask lots of questions. <laughs> uh, first up, let's talk about foot fungus. I know it's gross, but it's a real problem. It's a, it's a real problem. It is. A, it's a very real problem. Uh, in fact, recently the Roper organization did a survey, and they estimate about 35 million Americans have foot fungus, especially nail fungus. And what's worse is half those, more than half those people don't know that they have it and don't know what's effective to treat it. It's and, a real problem. And if you don't know what we're talking about, it's those commercials with that digger, that little creature, and he like pull, pulls up the nail and it's all yellow and gross. Okay. So, uh, and you are a spokesperson for that, right. for that company, so you are very, you're right. very aware. And of all this. you mentioned Digger. Uh, Digger is in town today. Digger's he's disgusting. <laughs> he is disgusting. He is. Um, and he's uh, making an appearance at Pimlico today. Um, all day there's a recreational vehicle that's going to be out at Pimlico. For the 5K run. For the 5K run. And there's going to be a podiatrist there that's going to offer free foot screenings. And there's the information that's on our screen right now. And um, the public, if they want to go out, they can actually get a picture taken with Digger. That Put your arm around Digger, send it out at Christmas, you know, <laughs> make yeah. a statement or something. But how do you recognize exactly what foot fungus is? Is it, I mean, a lot of people have like yellow gross nails for other reasons. Right. That, uh, there are other reasons, but if your nail, the classic characteristics are, if your nail's yellow, crumbly, and thick, it's a good chance that you have a nail fungus infection. Now, I, um, I have to tell you, I, I know two people that have foot fungus. One said, I'm not going to name names, said, I don't want to take it because I, I don't want to have liver problems. He's like right. about 65. The other one said, I don't want to take it because I'm going to make my hair fall out. Are those, are those things true? It's taking uh, a pill. Right. Uh, you, what you're talking about specifically is Lamisil. Exactly. Uh, and um, those are not true. Uh, okay. What happens, uh, the liver concern is a, is a very real concern, but every patient before they're given Lamisil, is sent for a blood test and we rule out any liver problems um, I never prescribe Lamisil if there's if the blood test comes back with any irregularities so the liver concern is not a uh, really justifiable concern the hair falling out yeah, maybe, <laughs> that, maybe the hair was just falling out anyway yeah I was gonna say that's a poor excuse for that uh, but there are other options you don't have to take the, the, a pill right well, not really. This is okay. actually what that survey that I referred to before found out. That most of the over-the-counter medications are not effective. There's just never been a study that's shown that any of those polishes or we all get these mail-order catalogs that advertise this for it and that for it. They don't work. Not, you have to treat this infection at its source, and that's why you have to treat it internally. Okay, Dr. Max Weisfeld, thanks for being with us this morning. Thank you very Please, much. I, so when you go to a cocktail party, do people just corner you and ask about foot problems? And he said, absolutely, yes. So thanks for answering all of our questions. Thank this you morning. very much. Okay, Lisa, over to you.